Hey, what's up? Jerry Sarnsky here with you on the Sports Geek. Really excited to continue with our sports betting glossary. We continue to add more and more terms for you here on the Sports Geek so you know all the terms when it comes to the sports betting industry. Today's word, public betting percentage. Before I break it down for you, make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell. If you want, leave a comment in the comment section. The public betting percentage is exactly what it sounds like. It's the amount of money the public is betting on a certain side for a game. For instance, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers play the Dallas Cowboys week one of the NFL football season. If 63% of the money line is on the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, that means that the public is riding the Tampa Bay Buccaneers to win. Now, isn't just the money line that public betting percentage is taken into. They do it for the spread, they do it for the over-under, and they do it for individual props like an individual player's passing yards or passing touchdowns. It's also important to note just because the public betting percentage is over 50% doesn't automatically mean that you should put money on that. In fact, the public is wrong more than they're right. But now you know what public betting percentage is and how it relates to the sports betting industry. I'm your host, Jared Chalinski. As always, thanks for tuning in. And more importantly, good luck with your bets. I'll see you next time here on The Sports Geek.